9 hole golf lock at Pompano Beach. First hole is a par 5, 490 yard dog leg left. I hit it over that bunker to give myself a good chance to reach the green in two. Wind right to left, hence the fade trying to cut it into the green so it runs towards the hole but it got stuck on the fringe. Tricky little chip but I made the best out of it. Nice bump and run, just short but a tap in for birdies enough. Off to hole number two, 400 yard, par four, dark leg left, trying to shape the hole with a draw to give myself a shorter yardage into the green. This one was a little bit overcompensated, a little snappy, off to the left, into the high grass. Tough, tough shot, but I'm able to open up the club face, get nicely through the ball, land the ball softly on the green, nearly hold out, but that putt was snappy, like the last two shots. Bogey on hole number two, off to hole number three, par three, 192 yard, cut free iron to make sure that it sits on the green and doesn't roll through. Now the putt looking really good and it lips out. Couldn't believe how that lipped out, but nice little par and we're off to hole number four. Par five, dog leg left, 500 yards. Cutting the corner over the trees. Second shot, decided to lay up in order to give myself a 60 yard shot into the green that I control really well and have higher chances of making birdie from there. Comes out just how I wanted it, but lands next to the pin and rolls out. Um, now I'm left with a 10 yard return putt which does not start on line. Unfortunately, no birdie here and tap in for par. Hole number five, 385 yard, dog leg left. We're cutting the corner again to shave off some distance on that hole and nice little approach into the green. Looks great. Yeah, we're putting for birdie. This time lining up the putt to give myself more chances of making it. But unfortunately, again, on the low side. Tap in for birdie, hole number six. Par three, 160 yard, was between clubs, took the longer one, didn't put a lot of effort in that shot. But the effort came back with this putt, trying to make that birdie from the distance, just a little short and tap in for par. Hole number seven, nice little par four, 395 yard, lost the balance on that tee shot and ended up in the rough. Now, 140 yard in, little fat, it's gotta go, but just short in the bunker. Unfortunately, plugged as well, and there's not much room to work with on the green. So the this question is, do I close the club face or do I open it? I decided to open it, put a lot of power into that shot, didn't get out, but the second shot out of the bunker works like a charm giving myself a good chance to still make bogey. But once again, I missed the putt on the low side and it's time to tap in for double and move on to hole number eight. Par four, dog leg to the right, 360 yard. Three wood off the tee, fades much too much and ends, ends up in the bunker. This is probably one of the toughest shots in golf, 90 yards out of the bunker over a lake onto the green and not bad actually just a little short definitely carried the bunker that was good and the approach now the chip like what i see now tap in for par not much of a tap in from that distance but par and we're off to hole number nine little push off the tee but it does carry the bunker giving me a 60 yard pitch into the green I gotta land it on the fringe and roll out because the pin is short. That's exactly what it does. Let's try to finish with birdie and we're in. Nice little finish. Great little round. Beautiful golf course.